Hello, my name is Patrick Wardrop. I'm the director for the IBM Verify product portfolio. Today I'm going to take you through an overview of our entire product portfolio, the use cases, and how they're deployed. The first use case is workforce identity and access management. That's all about managing employees' access to applications, how they single sign onto those applications, and how they get two-factor authentication for applications. The next one is consumer identity and access management, sometimes considered um, citizen identity and access management <coughs> for public sector. That's all around um, having um, uh, uh, customers or citizens have access to your enterprise services and products. For example, if you're a retail application, it's all around the experience around your customers logging into a retail application, creating self-creating their identities, and you know buying products. Um, additionally, on similar with finance, and then on the citizen side, it's all around public sector access to citizen applications. The next thing is identity governance and administration. That's all around the managing the life cycle of, of, an, of an employee accessing the system and all their entitlements governance. So things like um, the joiner use case. So when an employee joins a company, being able to provision their identity out to all of the business applications, making sure all their birthright applications, they have access to things like email and instant messaging applications. And then the, the mover use case, if an employee were to move from a sales department to a marketing department to ensure that the entitlements between those when they move jobs gets migrated correctly. And then last, uh, when they leave the company, being able to deprovision all of their access and remove their access to ensure that you meet your compliance requirements for your company. Next is privileged access management. That's all around allowing a, an administrator to access a privileged endpoint um, things like um, when an, an administrator goes to uh, do it, some sort of administration activity, it can screen record what they do, it allows them to check out the credential temporarily so they can access that privilege system, and then when they're finished with that system, they can check that credential back in. And that's all around monitoring and making sure um, privileged access is done correctly and there's no malicious activity. And then the last one is around security posture management, or sorry, identity security posture management, or ITDR, all right? That's all around um, continuously monitoring all of your identity infrastructure, being able to know what your users are doing, how they're use doing that, being able to identify shadow applications that maybe employees are using that aren't authorized, um, and if there's ever a breach, being able to go back and look at the full access path of what a human or non-human did to be able to access that particular target. How are all these products deployed? Right? We, we offer both self-managed software, so that can run um, either on on-premises infrastructure or on cloud. Right? So that's taking software, containers, virtual appliances and run them. And then cloud, so software as a service. So Verify offers the full deployment um, spectrum for all of our um, use cases. So we offer software um, um, capabilities, so just taking uh, software and installing that on a, on a system. We have virtual appliances where it's all containerized, a hardened system that can run on, on virtually any virtual stack. We have containers, so standard Kubernetes containers that run on any standard Kubernetes environment. And then last but not least, we have software as a service where we run all the software and services for you and you just manage all the use cases. All of these deployment spectrum options run on um, Amazon Web Services and can leverage ROSA, EKS, or EC2, depending on the deployment option that you choose. So let me go with um, IBM Verify. <clears throat> so IBM Verify covers workforce, consumer identity, and identity governance and administration, all three use cases in our SaaS. And at the end, I'm going to give you a reference where you can go and get a trial within a couple minutes be able to log into your own Verify subscription and try it out. Next, this is our this is our kind of foundation for all of our self-managed software, our, our, our Verify directory product. It offers similar deployment spectrum options, software, virtual appliance containers, and then the SaaS part of it is already included in IBM Verify. <coughs> the identity access product. So that uses the directory as a foundation. It provides modern authentication capabilities, 
um, authorization for employees or consumers, um, and it also provides two-factor authentication capabilities. So you can take that software, run it um, at all those different options, um, and provide those services for your um, employees or consumers. Then we have a product called Identity Governance. That product provides the identity governance and administration capabilities. Um, again, that is virtual appliances, software, and containers that run on AWS. And then we have a separate um, um, product portfolio called um, uh, Privileged Identity. Right? That has a, its own SaaS service as well as self-managed software. And then we have Verify Identity Protection. That product can run as a SaaS, as a SaaS product, but it also has a um, container option to be able to deploy on, on AWS. Here are some references. So at the very top, this is where you go and, and discover all of our product portfolio that I talked about here. And at the very bottom of that page, you can actually, there's a button to try for free. You just walk through a couple steps and within a couple minutes, you'll have a Verify SaaS subscription to be able to try out the product. The next link here is our Git, right? So we have an open source repository where we have some of adapters and examples for developers. And then the next four are the marketplace links for our um, AWS marketplaces. So the first one is our SaaS. So if you go to that link, it will allow you to walk you through to get a trial to run our SaaS service in AWS. The access link, that's to get our self-managed software, identity access, and be able to run it, run it yourself. <clears throat> the next one, the directory. So that's our virtual direct, or sorry, verify directory product. And then the last one, the ILM one, that's the identity governance and administration product. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and we'll see you at the next one.